Abby getting mic'd up. Abby, a black visually impaired woman, is presented to the camera holding a white cane. My name's Abby James Miller. I'm a disability activist and filmmaker. We're making a film about diversity, but more importantly, the fashion industry's relationship to it, because I feel like there's a problem. Abby interviewing a white model at London Fashion Week. Title, Diversity in Fashion. Time for change? As you can see, I'm a visually impaired 21-year-old who loves fashion. But so many people can't seem to fathom the fact that you can be both disabled and fashionable, and the fashion industry reflects that. As a person not only with a disability, but as a person of colour, I felt like I had to be an able-bodied white woman, as that was the pinnacle of beauty. Collection of fashion magazines. I feel it's about time that the fashion industry recognised that there is power in difference, and that they started to tackle this damaging narrative. In my opinion, it's about time that the D in diversity stood for disability, because at the moment, disability is so far removed from the conversation, it's unreal. Where's better to explore this issue than London Fashion Week? And that is exactly what Models on the catwalk at London Fashion Week. Everyone was talking about diversity, but where were the disabled people? Black people, white people, trans people, gay people, plus size people, skinny people. But where were the people that reflect me? So I've slated the industry enough. There are actually people out there actively championing the change. And one of the groups we spoke to was Models of Diversity. Angel, Models, Models of, of Diversity. Models of Diversity is a charity, a UK charity, and we champion for diversity inclusion in the fashion industry. We support um, aspiring models. We talk to the de designers, high street brands. We still find that there are very few designers that are using disabled models and if they do, it's a form of tokenism. Nadia. Representation with the modeling industry is getting better and there is some sense of diversity, but diversity is about inclusion with those who have disability as well as cultural and differences, religious backgrounds. Every Evan. campaign, every advert, every poster always needs to have a range of people. You always need someone with a disability, you need someone that's curvy, you need, you know, different people of colour, different body shapes and sizes. Clara. I was never dreaming about like doing modelling because I thought it's not possible for me with the cleft lip. I thought that I, I must be perfect. I feel Sassy. that assisted shopping is integral to a person's Sassy autonomy. Is looking at it can dresses. be really tricky if all the rails are too close together, the packages is all the same and then someone doesn't know how to assist me correctly. A member kind of staff empowering your staff Sassy. To, to just ask the question, how can I help? I really want to be a glamour model because I feel like I don't see a lot of disabled people specifically doing glamour modelling. I, I like to be like sexy and a bit raunchy. In reality, we're all models, we're all beautiful, we all can do this. I just want to get out there and almost like shock people. We would like for more people to join our movement mm. and let's change the world of fashion and make it a more inclusive place. This film isn't just about disability, it's about diversity in all forms. We spoke to so many people that also don't feel included in this industry. And we think it's so important that equal representation is a reality for the self-esteem and the self-worth of people everywhere. A collection of diverse models. Credits. Crew, Abby James Miller, Jessica Voucher, Tom Dwyer. Contributors Angel, Devon, Nadia, Clara, Cara, Sassy. Special thanks to Nandita and Onika. Hashtag Inclusive Fashion Matters.